everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I've got a video showing you three easy little steps that you can take to help secure yourself better grades. And that doesn't matter whether it is school or university or college, these tips will help you. But hold up, if you are new, don't forget to hit subscribe to my channel. I do have new videos every week and I appreciate it so much. All right, so these are tips that I've sort of picked up along the way myself. You might know some of them, you might not know others, but hopefully they're able to help you out. In my opinion, you don't have to be smart or traditionally you know, intelligent to be able to do well in a schooling system, you just have to know how your brain retains information and you have to have a willingness to learn and a willingness to actually want to do well. If you've got those two things, I can definitely help you out. If you do enjoy the video, I would love it so much if you would give it a thumbs up and let's jump into it. So I'll start off with the third tip and that is to make a study plan for yourself. Try to eliminate last minute cramming before your exams and set aside time each day or each week to make sure you're studying. I find it works best for me to put certain subjects on certain days and make sure that I have hours planned out for what I'm going to do during those subject study times. Week by week revision makes it a lot easier for you to remember everything that you need to and it will also eliminate the stress that cramming before an exam brings. My second tip is something that I just like to call quick notes. Each week I like to assess my weaknesses and a topic that I find I'm really struggling with, I like to make myself a little note document and I set a reminder for myself every day just to look over this to make sure that I'm remembering it again, refreshing it and hopefully, usually it means that it'll click and I'll understand it and then the next week I move on to the next topic that I'm struggling with if there is one. And my number one tip is to find out how your brain retains information the best. Are you a visual learner? Does your mind stray during lectures? Do you nearly knock people out when you talk with your hands? Are you a bit of an observer? Or are you more of an auditory learner? Do you get a bit distracted in the classroom? Do you whisper or talk aloud to yourself when you're reading? Do you have difficulty with written instructions? Or perhaps you're a kinesthetic learner and you like to tap and you fidget and you prefer to solve problems by physically working through them yourself. And I'm just gonna show you some tips for getting the best from your learning style. For those visual learners, make sure you're reading and writing out notes. Try and do a whole bunch of drawings, diagrams, charts. Use symbols to associate for words, color code different parts of your page and create different page layouts for yourself in your notes. For those auditory learners out there, make sure you're recording your lectures, record your notes. You can even do this on your phone, then you can listen back to them on your phone, listen to podcasts or watch videos. Try and study in a quiet environment and use rhyming techniques or study by talking through with someone. And for the kinesthetic learners, you can really take advantage of using mind maps and flow charts, get some movement happening while you're studying. So go for a walk, sit on a bike, play with some clay or some Lego. And a really good tip for kinesthetic learners is to put notes up around your room because you work well by studying in the space around you. Leave me a comment below, which type of learner do you think that you are? I am definitely a visual learner myself, and I hope that you're able to implement these tips and get much better grades for yourself in the coming semester or term or whatever you have coming up now. Catch you in my next video. Bye.